morning, everyone, and welcome to Fitness Friday. I'm Teresa Lepowski, and I'm here with Rick Houchin, a personal trainer at Bay Athletic Club. Rick's here today to tell us a little bit more about how we can survive the holidays in a healthy way. So, Rick, can you tell us a little bit about Turkey Days coming up? Yeah, it's crazy that we're like already in the holiday season. Um, and like we were talking a little bit before, that the average person gains one to three pounds during this six to eight week period coming up. Um, which doesn't sound really bad until I start telling you also that that one to three pounds normally doesn't come off and it leads into the winter time. So um, I'm going to share five quick easy tips to kind of help you navigate and have a game plan for the, the holiday season. And getting right into it, the number one in my opinion is don't overeat. You have okay. endless amounts of parties and get togethers and things like that. Don't overeat. Choose your portion control. Um, fill your plate up with healthy foods first and then stop when you're satisfied. You eat the healthy foods first and then you make your way to the treat table and you're not as hungry. That's it. That's it. All right. And I like it. That leads me to number two. Choose your treats wisely. Ah. Right? Okay. Learn that it's okay to say no. You don't have to walk up to the treat table and eat everything. Kind of glance over and go, I want one thing and have one thing and then move on with it. See, in my family, we have this thing called the Lepowski combo, and basically that means you can have not just two, but whatever treat is on the table, you can try one of them. So none of that. None of that. None of I don't want to get in, I don't want to get in the way of family tradition, but <laughs> it's best to just try one thing okay. and then move on. I'll try to keep I'll try to tell them that. <laughs> um, number 3. Um, when you go off to your parties and your get-togethers is don't overindulge in sugary drinks or alcoholic drinks. Okay. They are just empty calories. A lot of times they don't fill you up, which leads to just kind of overdoing them. And as we know with alcoholic drinks especially, it can lead to um, just over snacking later down the line. I've also heard that when you drink, you know, you over drink alcohol, um, your body, even if you do exercise, can't necessarily have the same results just because your body is trying to get rid of that alcohol. Is that, that true? Is, that is um, true. Your body um, can't exercise and can't uh, do its normal things if you've overindulged in, in some alcohol. Good to know. Good. Number four is um, we all have friends who like to bring in goodies and treats to the office. Oh, yes. Do your best to keep them out of the way. Right? Okay. Um, all back to my second rule of choose your treats wisely. But the way to kind of combat is bring something healthy as an alternative. Have yourself a healthy snack. That way if you do get hungry, um, you're not always going to the treat table. Or do something healthy for yourself before you indulge. Get up and do 10 squats, 10 jumping jacks, eat an apple, have a big glass of water before you okay. decide to go to the break room. Are there any desserts or treats that are more healthy than others? I'm thinking like pies have fruit or... If it has sugar no in it, around. yeah. No, I'm not going to condone that for you, Teresa. Okay. But like All right. fruit I tried. and then small pieces, right? If All you right. choose treat, small pieces. And then the last one is not really eating tip, but stay consistent with your workouts, right? A lot of us um, do good throughout the year and then when the holiday season comes it gets really busy and that is one of the first things to go. Um, stay consistent with your workouts and what it does is it puts you in a better mood, mm -hmm. less stress, um, you feel better, you're more confident and then it kind of helps beat back some of that weight gain if you did overindulge a little bit at one of your parts. Gotcha. Well thank you so much yeah. Rick. Everybody try your best. I know I'm going to try to avoid that Lepowski combo this year. <laughs> That's all we have for you today on Fitness Friday.